it's called a hollow position or it's a great I almost like it I do like it better than the hard style plank because what it does it teaches you how to move while staying rigid so, while and then what you're doing is you're flattening your lower back against the ground extending your legs out in front of you hey how's it going everybody it's Ryan Saplin here fat loss strength coach coming to you today with a video about core strength for kettlebell swings uh, I talked about on a previous video talking about hard style plank the next exercise I feel is a really great exercise is a, um, it's called a hollow position or a hollow rock. It's a great, I almost like it, I do like it better than the hard style plank because what it does, it teaches you how to move while staying rigid, while specifically working your core. And this will tie into kettlebell swing specifically because I'm going to show you here in just a second, is that when you lie down on your back and you do the hollow position, it's basically like a V up position. You're on your back like so. And then what you're doing is you're flattening your lower back against the ground, extending your legs out in front of you. And then what you're doing is you're basically creating a banana with your body. This is a hollow position. This is where I have people start out. Their core is activated, their legs are tight, their toes are pointing, their calves are activated. You're reaching up above your head and you're keeping everything in neutral. And then the advanced version, the hollow, this is a hollow, hollow rock is to rock like this. And now people are gonna do this a lot better than I, but. This is basically what you do. You're rocking back and forth almost on your tailbone, you know, and the way you know you're beginning to fail is you, you start to feel your lower back start to hurt. If at first this is too difficult, you can bring your feet higher up and this is simply a good way to hold it. If your neck gets tired, it just means you need to strengthen your neck muscles and you do short intervals. I like to do maybe the same thing with the, uh, the, the hard style plank where you're doing 20 seconds off, 10, uh, 10 seconds on, 20 seconds off. I'll just do 20 seconds hollow position, 20 seconds off, six rounds. It's a really great way to really get those core muscles going. So that way, when you start doing kettlebell swings, you're able to kind of tie those torso muscles in to those swings. That way, you can tie those core muscles in to that kettlebell swing, allowing you to keep these core muscles tight. If you'd like to get a free workout from me, a free kettlebell workout, I've got a free gift for you. Click over here or here, and I'll provide you a free kettlebell workout series. If you'd like to leave a comment, leave one below, or if you prefer to send me an email, you can email me at ryan at ryansaplin.com. Again, click like if you haven't already, subscribe if you're not a subscriber, and this is Ryan Saplin, Fat Loss Strength Coach, signing out. Thanks for watching.